morning vlog. I just woke up not too long ago. If you can hear, my window's open and the birds are still chirping. It's 10.30 in the morning. I really wanted to capture this moment right now. Ernie is sitting in my lap and he never sits in my lap. Um, I put him here, but he stayed, so. But anyways, I really want to have a reset day today for the springtime just to get it together a little bit. Whatever I end up doing today, I wanted to take you guys along with me. I'm still sitting in bed because I'm uploading a video for today. It's going to be up already by the time you watch this, which is kind of related to this video. It's my spring cleaning video, so make sure you guys watch that if you want to. So the plan for today is probably going to be doing some cleaning, maybe do some laundry, definitely do my nails because I haven't done them in so long. I was giving them a little bit of a break, but I really want to put some cute nails on, clean my makeup brushes, like do little tasks like that for today. I'm gonna continue to upload. I have to make a quick little thumbnail and then whenever I'm done with this, we will get the day started. Ernie is just so cute, I can't. The video is finally uploaded, so it's time to get up and get this day started. I feel so bad moving Ernie. Sorry, I have to get up. myself ready. I want to start off the day by going to the gym. I was gonna just do like an at-home Pilates workout, but I really want to like get a good sweat out. So I'm gonna go to the gym and do a quick 12 through 30 and maybe sit in the sauna for a little bit because I recently started going back in the sauna and it feels so nice, but it's also torture at the same time. I'm just gonna put on a little bit of makeup, look good, feel good, and throw on some gym clothes. This has been my favorite moisturizer. This is a CeraVe Ultralight Moisturizing Lotion and it has SPF 30. I used to use this one, which is a different formula, but I am obsessed with this one I'm gonna stop saying obsessed because I got like a comment the other day about like girls always say like they're obsessed Like yes, I am obsessed. I'm sorry, but I really do like this concealer <laughs> I can't <laughs> I can't I'm I can't today I've been waiting for this song to drop. gym fit for today. Ignore that pile of clothes because we're going to get into that later. But I'm just wearing these green alphalete shorts and this white zip up. It's such a nice day out so I wanted to wear some spring like colors. And I'm just going to refill my Stanley one of my shoes and then we're going to head to the gym. Alexa recently got us these like straw covers for a Stanley's and it's so cute. Put a little flower and now that I have this I'm like how did I go this long without having like a straw cover? Like I'm just thinking of like all the germs I probably slurped up. Really quickly, I'm popping into this vlog to tell you guys a little bit about today's sponsor. Thank you so much to Sohost for sponsoring this video. Sohost is Amazon's top seller for women's sunglasses. You guys may have already heard of them or may even have your own pairs of sunglasses from them. Maybe you guys might have heard of them by the name Sojos. I actually learned that it's pronounced Sohost because it's inspired by Spanish words and ojos means eyes in Spanish, which I thought was really cool. But they sent me a bunch of cute pairs of sunglasses that I'm going to show you guys. Now that it's spring season, now is definitely the time to start building up your sunglasses last collection. This is sold on Amazon which is super convenient. The shipping is fast and honestly I feel like a lot of you guys would like this brand just because it's so affordable and good quality. I'll have all the sunglasses linked down below and I also have a code for you guys to use. I'm going to show you guys all of the pairs that I have here. Starting off we have this pair. This is their retro aviator style and I got these in black and they have gold accents all around. These look so good. I personally love when sunglasses have a really big frame. I feel like this style always like makes you look put together so these ones are really 
cute. I'm a super big fan of this style. And then this is the next pair I got. These ones are in the amber tortoise shade. They have like the orangey brown pattern on the side and they also have a little bit of gold detailing. This pair is definitely more rectangular and more narrow compared to the first one. I think this style is so cute. I was kind of nervous that it wouldn't work with my face shape, but I love them. Next we have another pair of aviators. These ones are a lot more simple than the first one. These are all black. Like I said, I love the aviator look. I love the big frames. I like this one for the days that I want to wear like gold jewelry because the other one has more gold accents. This next pair is super fun. These ones are a bit more cat eye shape. They're all black with some more gold accents. It just says the brand name in gold on the side. These ones are so fun. I don't have sunglasses like these. They definitely have more style because of the cat eye shape. If you haven't already noticed, I got most of my sunglasses in black and neutral colors because I just feel like it's easier that way to match everything. These next sunglasses have more of an oval shape. They have this little silver design on the side. I think these are so cute. I was actually nervous that these frames like wouldn't look good on my face, but I think they look really cute. And these ones are also super dark, so it's going to be perfect for a bright sunny day like today. And then these are the last ones. This one's brown with gold accents and has like the tortoise pattern. They have more of a rounder shape. This is how they look on. Very similar to the first one, but just a bit more round. These ones or the first pair might be my favorite. Perfect for a casual outfit, an everyday look. So those were all the sunglasses. So make sure you guys check them out. Again, I'll have everything linked down below. Thank you so much again to Sohos and let's go ahead and get back into the vlog. Alright guys, I'm all finished with today's workout. It was actually a very good one. I ended up doing shoulder and tricep with some cardio and I sat in the sauna for a little bit. But while I'm out, I think I'm gonna go and clean my car because it's been really gross. Like the outside is so dirty, like I'm actually embarrassed. So it's time to get a car wash. And I just need a vacuum in here and throw out all the trash. So we're gonna go do that. And then I might like stop by and get something to eat because I'm so hungry. This is how my car looks. I just have stuff everywhere and a lot of trash. The line for the car wash is so long. So I stopped by Chick-fil-A. I got a grilled sandwich and they gave out like free tenders. So I'm just gonna eat this while I wait in line for this car wash. finished cleaning it looks so much better in here and I just found a new pack of air fresheners in here this is the gain detergent scent I love the smell of gain I'm so happy I have these so I don't need to go to the store to get more because I love having my car smell good after I clean it usually I like to get the ones that like are invisible like these ones these smell so good the linen kind it makes my car smell so fresh but since I already have these I'm just gonna put these ones in Oh my gosh, this air fresher smells so good, but this car wash is so busy. So I'm getting overstimulated and I need to leave I'm sitting in my bathroom and I was gonna take a shower, but I realized it's hair wash day and whenever it's hair wash day I like to oil my scalp for a little bit and then shower So I'm gonna oil my hair and I use the Miel rosemary oil and then this essential 17 hair growth oil And I put that all throughout my hair and massage it with this hair massager thingy. It stimulates your hair follicles all oiled up and while this is like soaking into all that dryness i am going to go ahead and clean all of my makeup brushes this is way overdue i'm pretty sure this is adding up to my breakouts having all these dirty brushes i have all of them right here they're so gross and all of my dirty beauty blenders but i'm finally going to give them a really good wash and i'm going to be using this little soap bar from beauty blender and then i also have some dish soap because i do like to use dish soap on some of them so yeah this will probably take me like 20 to 30 minutes that gives my hair some time to soak in this oil and i'm also going to use this sigma brush mat thing you just clean the brush in the different sections on here and then it helps it clean better so i'm going to do that watch a show and then and take a shower after.
taking a bit of an everything shower. I put a hair mask in, exfoliated, shaved, and then I lotioned up with my favorite lotion ever. But now it's nail time. I made a coffee as a pick me up because I did not have any caffeine today. And look at my new spring cup. It is so pretty. I got this from Home Goods. So cute. I use it every morning. So I think I'm gonna go with my basic short almond French. I really wanted to do chrome nails, the like glazed donut nails, but I don't have chrome powder, so I'd have to order that. If I ordered it, it wouldn't come until tomorrow, and I really want to do my nails now. I think I'm gonna order it anyways, and then the next time I do my nails will definitely probably be chrome. But I think we're just gonna go with the classic short French. My nails are gonna take me a good like two hours though. So by the time I'm done, it's probably gonna be nighttime, and it's, it's already starting to get so dark in here but yeah i'm just gonna do my nails i'm really excited to not have them look like this anymore either of my options they're just plain because i really really wanted to do the chrome so i ordered it and i'll just finish my nails tomorrow i will show you guys how it ends hi i will show you guys how it ends up looking this took me so long my back is hurting now I'm probably gonna get ready for bed soon but before i do that i really need to put away my laundry i have a lot of folding to do. I did laundry and I just have it in a bag and I need to fold it and put it away. So I'm thinking about just like putting on some eye masks, putting on my favorite comfort show, lighting some candles, putting on my lights, and just end the night that way. I'm really tired. I feel like this reset like wasn't as much as I usually do because I already deep cleaned my whole room. Usually in all my resets I do more cleaning stuff but I already did that in my last video so there wasn't as much cleaning to do. I'm gonna start to wind down for tonight. I'm really tired. Thank you. 